Welcome back once again to my YouTube class guys. I'm Manjit Rawat, your online instructor. This is another session of VMA virtualization and in this session I'm going to define you about how you can manage the clone ta and templates. So these two important services which is available in you can say that in vCenter server. So uh, in this class you can say that uh, I'll give you the complete information about why you need to create your uh, clone of your virtual machine and in which case we need to create a template for the VM. And we'll also try to understand about the step to configure the clone and template. So first of all, what we need to do, uh, this is our setup that we configured. So we have a two different ESXi, one vCenter server, ESXi 192.168.1.10 and ESXi 2 is 192.168.1.12. So two ESXi hosts available in same vCenter server and in last session, uh, I guide you how you can add the ESXi host to vCenter uh, data center. So now I'm planning to provide you provide you information about the clone and template. So guys, uh, if we talk about the meaning, so as per the name suggests, like in case uh, we have a two different ESXi or uh, three different ESXi host in our environment, and uh, each and every ESXi contain a virtual machine. Like as a one ES virtual machine contained by ESXi one, one virtual machine which is contained by the ESXi two, and ESXi three contain one virtual machine. The meaning of clone like uh, you install windows 10 operating system in your virtual machine with uh, multiple services multiple services in the sense like as uh, you install some application services some driver some uh, uh, official software as well now you want to create another virtual machine but you want to use the everything same same as a virtual machine that you created before like you don't want to invest time, you don't want to waste the time to install uh, application or driver, drivers from scratch again with new virtual machine. So in this case, we are able to make a clone of same virtual machine that we have already created. Second important part, while creating the clone, we are able to find option. You can put your clone machine on any ESXi host, which is available in, in our environment like the ESXi which is contained virtual machine and you want to create a clone but you want to put the clone over a ESXi 2 so it's also possible you can put it into the ESXi 3 as well right so as per the name suggest if we talk about the meaning of uh, clone so as per the name suggest with the help of clone we are able to create a copy of our existing virtual machine what are the prerequisites we just need to use the normally step I'll, I'll show you the step how you can create a clone but once the clone is completed means your virtual machine is ready to use as a clone you must need to execute a command sysprop right with the help of this particular command you can change the mac address and also the configuration of your virtual machine because uh, in case of clone it will be create another copy another same copy of your virtual machine like with same ip address same computer name and same mac address as well so if you are using the same MAC address or IP address for another virtual machine, so it may be create a problem, it will create a confliction between each other. So that's why you need to execute the command of sysprop. And whenever you execute the uh, sysprop command, it gives you option to change everything. So guys, this is the meaning of clone. But if we talk about templates, so I'm just going to create a template of same virtual machine that we created. So meaning of template like you want to create multiple virtual machine and every 10 days every 15 days you need to create a same virtual machine so in this case what you need to do you need to create a master copy the template is considered as a master copy and you need to convert your virtual machine to template and with the help of template you can create n number of vm whenever you want to uh, create a new vm you just need to create with the help of template so this is the actual difference between uh, clone and template means uh, you can say that master copy of VM that help us to create multiple VM. Fine, so I'm going to show you the step how you can configure the uh, clone and template. So I have already accessed our uh, vCenter server and under the vCenter server we are able to find uh, uh, two different ESXi. I'm going to create one virtual machine only for the, uh, uh, just, just only for uh, uh, testing purpose. I'm going to create one VM and we will use a clone and template to uh, uh, convert our virtual machine 
into the template and will create a clone by using the same machine. You can proceed with any name like uh, I want to put with Windows 10 and create uh, just want to put it into the 192.168.1.10 next we have only single storage which is local storage so proceed with same local storage next and operating system you can select the template of operating system as per your requirement I don't want to proceed with uh, 40 gig just uh, 15 gig is enough right and should we use the thin provision because we have already discussed about the difference between thin and thick provision 4 gig of RAM is too high just proceed with 2 gig of RAM next as we know that we don't have operating system in this particular VM but you are able to perform the task of cloning and template so one virtual machine is ready to use the virtual machine is Windows 10 that we created right okay so I'm going to show you the step how you can create the temp clone and after that we'll discuss about the template so this is our Windows 10 machine that we created it and uh, right click on your virtual machine it gives you option to create a clone select clone what you want to do you want to create a clone to this VM clone to template and clone to the template library so I want to create it clone to the virtual machine type the name of your virtual machine uh, that you want to create with the help of cloning option so type the name clone vm windows 10 okay it's a fully depend upon you you can put it any name this is our data center click next where you want to put it you want to put it into second ESXi 1.12 or you want to create a clone of your virtual machine and put on the same ESXi so both options are available so I, I want to Transfer, I want to create a clone on second ESXi host. Next, how much space you want to provide? You can select the space size, just need to select the storage and then next. No need to make any changes in this particular panel. Next and finish. As we know that we don't have any operating system, that's why you are able to create immediately. Your clone is ready to use. With the same configuration and with same operating system that you installed in your existing VM. So the meaning of clone, you want to create another copy of same virtual machine, then you need to proceed with clone. And now about the templates, if you want to create, if we talk about the template services, so template in case of template, you are you want to make a master copy of your virtual machine. So I'm just going to convert our Windows 10 virtual machine to into the templates into the master copy. Right click not clone this time we need to proceed with template so just need to select template option convert to the template export to the uh, OVA template so see try to understand about the difference between each other uh, OVF is the open virtual file if you want to um, transfer your virtual machine from uh, physically transfer your virtual machine from one location to another location you want to uh, transfer your virtual machine into pen drive or external storage so then you that time you need to proceed with OVF. If you want to put the master copy on the same ESXi, then proceed with convert to the template. So I'll give you the information about OVF, but first of all, we need to install at least one operating system in our virtual machine, then we'll guide you properly. Convert to the template, yes. Within second, our virtual machine converted to the master copy, right? So how we can get it? Because we are unable to find Windows 10. Data center and this is the template and VM. Click here. We are able to find one option is Windows 10. This is the type of template, right? So what we need to do, right click on your template, not VM, and create new VM, new VM from the, this template. And template is still available on the same page and you can create a N number of virtual machines. So just, I'm just going to create one virtual machine, win 10, temp one right so I want to create the virtual machine with the help of our Windows 10 template where you want to put it 12 or 10 it's depend upon you next select the data store where you want to put uh, the uh, uh, template uh, virtual machines and create one virtual machine is ready to use I want to create another VM right click again you need to use the same step right 
Type the name of your virtual machine, bin 10 temp 2. Fine. And this time I want to create the virtual machine in second ESXi host. Next. Data storage. Next. And finish. See, template is available on the same page, but you are able to create a n number of virtual machines. So it means that with the help of uh, template, we are, actually the meaning of template it's a type of master copy, and with the help of master copy, we are able to create n number of virtual machines. Guys, I hope you all of you understand about the concept, a uh, difference between clone and template. So I think it's enough for today, and we'll connect uh, tomorrow and discuss more about the vCenter server environment. Thank you guys and please do subscribe your Teach Me Cloud YouTube channel uh, because you know that Teach Me Cloud can give you 100% live practical based video without skipping any step. So take care and bye bye. We'll connect soon with another technology. Bye bye guys.